Many of us can probably remember our parents and grandparents reading to us when we were growing up. The Hungry Caterpillar, Thomas the Tank Engine and the famous Five all came alive at bath and bedtimes. Now research shows that children who are read to tend to do better at school and are more confident reading themselves. A new campaign is being launched to give mums and dads tips on reading to their children. Marmite has teamed up with Reading for Life to offer free downloads of popular children's character Horrid Henry. Sing at Sinita is also involved hoping to bring his stories to life. I'm involved in this campaign because anything that encourages children to read and actually probably more importantly parents to read to children is something I would avidly support. Um, growing up as an only child books were like my escape, my a lot of my education and just pleasure really. I, I almost prefer to pick up a book than watch TV. Marmite in order to encourage parents to read to children, they are giving away audio downloads of the Horrid Henry series. So you can buy a jar of Marmite, the promotional jar, and in return receive one of the Horrid Henry stories to download, which is great because if you're like cooking breakfast or dinner or something and you want the kids sort of around you but not actually in your hair, you can't read them a story because you, you know you're busy, you can stick it on and they'll actually sit and listen and you can interact with them while you're doing whatever else you're doing and it's, I find it really helpful and in the car, especially or when you're on the telephone. <laughs> Today we got to preview uh, one of the chapters from the latest Horrid Henry book. Um, very tantalising because we're only allowed to read one chapter, so we read chapter four, um, which sort of gives you a conclusion, but you really then want to know, like, who are these people and what else happened? Um, and it was great, really captured the children's imagination. They sat and they listened and they got engrossed and uh, really enjoyed it as well. Studies show children who read and are read to at home before starting school have a much better vocabulary and are much more confident in the classroom than those who don't. It's important to introduce children to reading uh, and there's actually it's never too early, absolutely never too early to introduce children to reading um, but also to listening to stories. It's not just about words on a page, it's about hearing stories as well because the more words that children hear, enjoy and understand before they start school, the better they will do literally for the rest of their lives. And there's an old fashioned maxim which is children who get read to get ahead and that's absolutely the case. What it's important to say is that uh, none of it has to be difficult. It's all about fun. Um, it's one of the few things I can think of that's free, especially if you join your local, local library. You can do it absolutely anywhere and at any time. Your children love you for doing it because you're doing something with them. They think you're really cool. And somehow you're managing in the middle of all of that to provide your kids with the best possible um, equivalent of a private education. So nobody loses. I like stories very, very much. And um, I really like books from school. I like reading Horace Henry because it's totally wicked and it does so bizarre things. So, um, I read to myself. I've seen Howard Henry and Sunita and it's really quite fun thing and I was so excited to get up and get dressed to go here. Reading offers children the chance to explore different worlds and helps them to understand new words and phrases. And it certainly seems that the children here have enjoyed hearing from Sunita and all about one of their favourite characters' escapades.